The best thing you can do when learning information is to have learning sessions. So you know how long you're going to be learning, then you're able to you know, learn the information and then take a break and go do other things. Not overwhelm yourself with all this information you're trying to learn. So for example, learning Spanish, man, if you want to go through a whole chapter in one day, that's so much information and you're not going to have enough time to process it all, especially when you sleep, which is where a lot of processing happens. So what you should do is have different lessons because that makes it so much easier for you to know what you're learning today. So if you're doing a lesson per day, then you know, okay, oh, right now I'm on number lesson one, right? Boom. So you know, you go through that. Then tomorrow, oh, tomorrow's going to be lesson two. And so whatever information is going to be in there, maybe, you know, this is, they have it like different like kind of flashcards. And so uh, maybe day two, you have 52, right? Day one, you have 30. That's okay. But you're going to practice whatever whatever you're learning on that specific lesson that day so you're not overwhelmed. So you learn all these specific you know, phrases for day two. Then you just go practice that for the rest, for, for the rest of day two, for the rest of the learning session, right? And so that makes it so much more structured, which is going to help you learn information so much faster compared to, okay, lesson one, let me do it, blah, 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 got through it. Okay, let me go lesson two, da, da, da. lesson three, uh, okay, I feel kind of tired, let me stop. Because you're just kind of just shoving everything in. And especially with the language where there's more um, to it than just, hey, saying a word back, right? Or calling a specific word. You need the grammatical structure of the sentence. And so depending on the information, there can be a lot more things than just the information itself. And all these little small things that you do need to be able to recall or say correctly. And so I recommend whatever you're, you're learning to break it into learning sessions because it makes it so much easier and it makes it more um, kind of motivating for you to like, oh, I got number one, boom, boom, boom. Oh, tomorrow, I can't wait to you know, learn uh, <laughs> tomorrow's lesson because I'll be able to see how it uh, connects with lesson one, you know? So you're doing all these things to kind of, kind of set you out, set yourself up for success as much as possible. So hopefully you enjoyed this video and I'll see you next time.